pass for, a, for this little pole here. He's trying to get unhooked. <laughs> I mean, he's a decent, I think he's a Guadalupe. It's a decent Guadalupe. Either that or a largemouth. <laughs> ah. Oh, that's a big guad. Oh, no, it's a largemouth. It's a largemouth. Yeah. Dun, dun, dun. That's why I was going to ask you to put on a bigger fly. <laughs> you cooked. I know they're, 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 this is where I caught like a bunch of them. Like, you want to put on a bigger fly? Okay. I know they're, they're, I don't think you're going to get them to bite on that little fly, the bigger bass. Oh man. Here. So. Here, hold, hold on, I'll come over here in just a minute. Get you another fly. Ah, oh, shoot. I tried to reproduce this fly that I have, but I put black bead chains on it instead of gold. And the black bead chain doesn't seem to doesn't seem to catch them. Mike, you're right next to those trees. Oh man, I missed a bite. Uh-oh. Something hit it. Hit it on the side. Oh, it's this little perch. I know there there's Uh, here, come over here and I'll, I'll give you a fly. Huh? Yeah, and I bet you would have caught some bass. Because that, that's kind of a panfish fly right there, that one you have. this one but here's but here but what you got to do is b before you cast it that's really not all that small for what, what kind of fishing we're doing but maybe maybe a little bit bigger wouldn't oh shit I dropped it what your line Oh, I didn't? No. Oh. I mean, if you want to use this one, this might be good too. This is called, this here is called a uh, lunch money right here. Mm -hmm. how, how many twists do you do? I do about 10 or so. I'm going to try this lunch money right here. They, they say this guy uh, makes a living off tying these flies right here. He, he came up with this pattern. It's called a lunch money. Let's see. I try to mimic it, but uh, but uh, it, uh, mine always seem to float. They don't sink. I think I'm getting better at them. Do 
that you didn't see that Gasper goo? Oh man, that thing was huge. They're big, but they're like a fragile fish, man. When you catch them, it's like their uh, scales fall off and yeah. yeah, they're a freshwater drum, but they're not at all like their saltwater ones. You catch them and, and you're like in the water and you'll see all these scales floating from them flailing around. That's, that's another one of them fish that are hard to catch. You said wet it? Yeah, take it with your hand and do, the, do that. Okay. How does it, now, now, now just sink, sink in it, because I tied that and that's kind of a new pattern for me yeah. with new material. How does it do? Does it sink? Let it sink. Need to put some more bend. Ooh, the, the, ooh, the bass are after that thing. After, they're after the lunch money. Yeah, them, I, you know, I don't know how to catch those carp. Oh, man. This might catch a big bass here, Mike. This one. I mean, because this, this guy, this fly, it's caught like... 30 inch red. Oh. See, if, if, if you would concentrate on getting your, your line, your loop of your fly line to tighten up, your cast would get so much better. You're casting with a very large loop in your fly line, okay? and. and See, see now, now look. look what, let me watch, show you. Look, watch what I do when I on my back cast. Okay, I pull, and then it, I let the fly line, I let the fly rod, pull the line out of the water. I let it load. That's the term. Load. That's the thing. When, when I caught that fish. Ooh, ooh, man, they're they're chasing that one. Look at that. Look at that. The, the bass is going after it. Yeah, they're hard to catch, man. Oh, he, he had it. Carp eat minnows. But, oh, man, they, they had it. Because once you learn how to load that pole up, your, 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 your fishing's gonna get 10 times better. When you learn to load the pole and not cast the fly, you're, you're, you'll be, huh? You're, I mean, because you're, you're not using the pole at all. Ah, oh, shit. What? Yeah, they, they do. Yeah, I figured that would be a good a good pattern. Man, look at those those car those carps would be not they would be so much fun to catch, but those cichlids are right there, man. You know, everyone talks about this lunch money, and, and, and I've yet to catch a fly on it, or catch anything on it. Oh, well, maybe it's too big. But it, it, it's, it, it's, when it wets up, man, it's like the perfect minnow pattern. Also, see how much fly line I have hanging out? 
that that's that's how much you, you kind of got to have it that much hanging out and uh you kind of have you kind of you kind of have to have enough ooh, hang out that you want to to, to catch oh man that cichlid was chasing it and you know your your pant leg will hinder your fly cast they're, they're chasing it well, let's see I'm gonna go get my other. Let's see why. I'm gonna see if I got that ghost man. That ghost man is a good now. Oh, this this is probably a good pattern here too, man. I'm, I wish I would have had something like this the last time I came out here. I was like, yeah, I need to. Huh? 